check out the new mass metal ally this thousand watt bulb i'm gonna plug this thing in start it up and tell you guys all about it so there it is turning on now just plugged it in and as you can see it is starting to glow there's a mixture of elements that are ignited powered by the ballast which is plugged into the wall and the electricity flows through heats up the elements they vaporize and mix together to form the light and they glow so it takes five minutes for this thing to fully turn on which means i get to tell you guys all about it while you watch it slowly warm up and get brighter and brighter um so right now it's starting to get pretty bright the camera is on auto so it's going to adjust to that brightness just so that you can watch what's happening rather than look at a white screen because it's just getting brighter and brighter but basically i'll tell you guys all about these bulbs so the metal halide is in my experience the absolute best type of light to use for flowering which i know that goes against probably what you've heard a lot of people have mistakenly claimed that these are for veg only probably so they can sell you a high pressure sodium for flowering sell you another bulb but when used properly the metal halide is actually going to give you higher quality denser more flavorful higher potency additional cannabinoids and terpenes oftentimes in the same clones this is what we saw in our lab results um and yeah basically it's a super super bright this is one of the brightest metal halides you'll ever find um it's competitive with an hps so in the past people would get lower yields with metal halide partly because they were not as bright so they need to be positioned a little bit closer to the plants but you can't really tell it with your eye because your eye is always adjusting to brightness too it's hard to tell so you really need to use a bar meter measure the light levels and use it properly and if you do that you're going to get great results with any light doesn't matter if it's metal halide hps led cmh even um you will see differences with each light but if you measure the light levels at your canopy properly you're going to get great results the thing that sets metal halide apart is that it has the most sun-like spectrum out of any of these light sources even cmh um a good metal halide like this one can have a 6000 kelvin spectrum which is just like sunlight during midday and as you'll see soon this is still turning on so the colors shift for a few minutes but it's going to end up as a super white clear light and it looks very very similar to sunlight and the spectrum chart shows that it's more like sunlight um in many ways far more like sunlight than leds for example and yeah so we've noticed really great results um huge yields really good lab reports some strains producing additional cannabinoids additional terpenes and i mean you can smell it in the finished bud that a lot of strains are just better when flowered under metal halide compared to other light sources so if you're into quality and you want to balance quality with high yield as well this is the perfect lamp for you so basically it's i would say the perfect lamp for anybody because who doesn't want higher quality get a more enjoyable experience better medicine uh, maybe a better price for it if you're selling it if you're a legal dispensary you know and yeah so i put together a website where i have a ton of info because i want to teach you guys everything there is to know about this light and how to use it properly avoid any uh mistakes or anything like that so you just crush it on your first grow do a really good job we're releasing these on 420 2024 so if you're seeing this video after that it's already available and if not stay tuned um massmetalhalide.com you can learn more and yeah basically we're four and a half minutes into the startup period now so it's almost at full power and you can see it's got a little bit of a more orange glow than when we started there's a little bit of sodium in here for some good red energy but it's still heating up and turning whiter and whiter basically you just wanted to introduce this bulb it's a custom bulb from us so 
you can't buy this anywhere else. There are different brands on the market, and I would say if if you get any metal halide that has a 6000 spectrum, it will be similar. It won't be the same thing, but you're going to get a great result flowering under metal halide, and part of me releasing this is just to spread the awareness and hopefully to offer the best bulb on the market. I want to offer something a little bit better than the best of what's available. Um, so yeah, hope you guys like it and stay tuned for more videos, more news, and tips and advice and all that. Yeah, check out massmetalhalide.com. You can read all about reflectors and ballasts and growing techniques and par measurements and benefits of our spectrum. Um, the UV in our light is much better than the UV produced by any LED around. The infrared is really important for plants and that is produced better in this bulb than even in the HPS, but also especially compared to LED you'll see much healthier plants using our bulb and use a lot less nutrients in many cases to keep them happy. So, massmetalhalide.com, there you go. A thousand frames per second slow-mo version of the startup. So, this is one second of action slowed down to over a minute long so you can really see just things your eyes would never see i mean first of all you should never look at this bulb during startup or at any time but pointing a camera in slow-mo is really neat just to see how the arc goes through and is searching for the best path and it's initially all wavy and then it starts to straighten out real quick and immediately starts to glow as the elements heat up from the electrical arc and the heat that that produces and then basically the stable arc ignites the rest of everything and it gets extremely bright so hope you enjoyed that little slow-mo